Let's read it together. It's on the wall. And he took them in his heart. And he blessed them. Lay his hands upon them all. Amen. That was Jesus Christ. The apostles that were with Jesus Christ, they were trying to discourage parents from bringing their children to Jesus Christ. And the Lord says, do not suffer them to come to me. Let them come. It was an evening session like this. Many parents who are very obedient, the wise one like you and I, they brought their children to the Lord Jesus Christ for him to pray upon them, for him to lay his hand upon them. And what happened? Some people were discouraging them. And he said, suffer not them to come. For such is the kingdom of God. And the Bible says, the Lord Jesus Christ took them in his hand. He took those children as they are coming one by one. So as your children are coming one by one tonight, maybe they are not here, but you don't have their names. The Lord says, he will carry them in his hand. And he will not only do that, he will bless them. Amen. <laughs> so he says, he will lay his hands upon them. Amen. And so shall it be. The first prayer procession. The first, say, first prayer session, you will shout the name of Jesus Christ. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus. Take my children in your whole heart. That's the prayer point. Begin to pray. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. Take my children up in your whole heart, O Lord. Hold them in your whole heart. Mention the name of those children. Say, Lord, I have brought my children to you tonight. I have brought my children. I have brought to you to you. I have brought Shehi to you. Begin to mention them. I have brought my children to you. I have brought Jacob to you. I have brought James to you. Hold them in your whole hand, O oh Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus. I have brought Mary to you. I have brought John to you. Lord, in your mercy. Hold them, O oh Lord. In your whole heart, O oh Lord. Carry them through all journeys of life. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus, carry my children all through their journeys of life. In the name of Jesus. Say, my children must not be stranded. Carry them in your own hand. Father, in the name of Jesus. Every parent, please pray this prayer very well. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus, carry my children in your own heart. In the name of Jesus. My children must not be stranded. They must not fall. They must not falter. Carry them, O oh Lord. Carry my children in your own heart, O oh Lord. Carry my children in your own heart. They must not suffer lameness, physical lameness. They must not suffer spiritual lameness. They must not suffer. Carry my own children, Lord Jesus, in your own heart, O oh Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. 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 In Jesus' name. The Bible says that's prayer session number two. We are going. I want every prayer to pray this prayer very well. Jesus carried those children in his house. And so I pray for you. Tonight, every child that comes out of your womb, Jehovah will carry them. In the name of Jesus. It means your children will not be stranded. They will not be stranded. In the mighty name of Jesus. A woman was trying to carry a child at a point in time. And the Bible says she mistakenly, because of the stress and the struggle, drop that child and for the lifetime of that child he was lame he was physically lame and pray for you in the mighty name of jesus as your child has been carried by jesus christ every form of lameness today i reduce I reject, I rebuke in the name of Jesus. The whole children, they will not suffer physical lameness in the name of Jesus. Spiritual lameness, they will not suffer it in the name of Jesus. So shall it be. Amen. Prayer session number two. The Bible says, and Jesus Christ put his hands upon those children. You are going to go before the Lord. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus, let your hands be upon my children. Turn that to prayer. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, Almighty God, put your hand, your blessed hand, put your mighty hand upon my seat in the name of Jesus. Remove every ungodly hand from my seat in the name of Jesus. Every ungodly hand, every ungodly hand, let it be removed, oh Lord. Put your mighty hand upon my seat in the name of Jesus. Every ungodly hand upon my
you are really praying and you are not praying, you are deceiving yourself. I am praying for you and I decree by the name of Jesus. Though you may not take it serious, but the prophecy is coming out. I release by the power of God every ungodly hand upon your children. Today I confirm those and in the name of Jesus. Every evil hand upon your children, those hands are cut off in the mighty name of Jesus. Give you hand that he must control your sin. Tonight I put an end to it in the name of Jesus. So shall it be. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Number three, Amen. number three. And the Bible says Jesus Christ did what? He blessed them. How many parents want their children to be blessed here? Please come to prayer. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. Bless my seed. Every seed that comes from, from my womb. If a woman, a man here, touch your womb, touch your womb. Every woman here, touch your womb. If a man, touch your heart. Every child that comes out from my womb, Lord, bless them. Bless my children in the name of Jesus. Begin to pray. Be prophetical. Say, Lord, bless my seed. Let them be blessed. As you bless Abraham, say, as you bless Abraham, bless my seed. As you bless Daniel, bless my children with wisdom. Parents, I want you to open your mouth. Say, Lord Jesus, as you bless the world. Bless my children with leadership spirit in the name of Jesus. Say, bless my seed, bless my children. As you bless Mary, bless my children with glory of children. Say, as you bless David, bless my children with godly heart. Say, Lord Jesus, say, Lord Jesus, as you bless Jacob, bless my children with blessings that run from generation to generation. Say, Lord Jesus. Bless my seed. Bless my children. Lay your mighty hand upon every child that comes from my womb. In the name of Jesus, so shall it be. Amen. I pronounce the blessing of Abraham Amen. upon all the children here Amen. and those ones that are not here Amen. and they belong to you. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. The blessing of Abraham. The blessing upon Daniel, the blessing upon David, shall be your home portion in the name of Jesus. So shall it be. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. 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 Please, please don't be distracted. I want you to have faith. The next 30 minutes is going to be stronger. Please have that faith. The Lord has prepared those prayer points. All that you need is just that faith. Cash it. And thank God you have brought your children here. You're going to go to prayer session number four. Say, Lord Jesus. I rededicate my children to you, Lord. I rededicate. I rededicate James. I rededicate to you. I rededicate Joseph. I rededicate Daniel. I rededicate David. Unto your whole time again. In the name of Jesus. Every ungodly altar that my children have been dedicated. I remove their names. And I rededicate them. Unto the altar of peace. In the name of Jesus, see, I dedicate my children. Name them one by one. Every parent here, do not keep your mouth shut. Begin to rededicate. See, I dedicate my children. I dedicate them unto the altar of God. In the name of Jesus, I dedicate my children to you, Lord. In the name of Jesus, parents, I want you to pray very well. I dedicate my children. I remove their name from every ungodly altar. In the name of Jesus, I remove your name from every holy altar. In the name of Jesus, pray and open your mouth. Say in the name of Jesus, I dedicate my husband, I dedicate my second husband, I dedicate my children on the altar of peace. In the name of Jesus, so shall it be. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Amen. As many children that are here, and as many parents that are here. All your children, by the name of Jesus, I read and they to them. Back to the altar of peace, in the name of Jesus. The children will give you peace, in the name of Jesus. I read and they all your sins, on the altar of God of peace. They will bring forth joy. They will give you peace, in the name of Jesus. The children shall give you peace, because they are dedicated. Back to the altar of God. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Prayer number 
five. Say, I soak my children in the blood of Jesus. I am looking for serious parents here. Because God knows why he has called you here tonight. He has called you here so that changes will begin to happen in the life of those children. Open your heart and say, blood of Jesus. Call blood of Jesus. Call blood of Jesus. Call blood of Jesus. Blood of Jesus. Begin to flow upon my children. Blood of Jesus. Begin to flow upon my seed. In the name of Jesus, I soak my children. I soak the roof. I soak James. I soak Dada. In the blood of Jesus. Soak your children. In the blood of Jesus. Soak them all. In the blood of Jesus. Begin to soak them. Soak your children. In the blood of Jesus. Say, Lord, let your wonderful eyes and masterful eyes be upon my children. In the name of Jesus. Say, Lord Jesus. Before the Lord, say Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus. remove, oh Lord, oh Lord. every ungodly spirit that make that can make my children to be useless in life. Listen, it is not every child, no matter how glorious they are, that they never want them to succeed. You are blessed that you are here tonight, and as many that are here tonight, the Lord says, The obedient one, I will honor them. You are going to go before the Lord. Say, Lord, remove every ungodly spirit. For can make my children to be useless now. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus. Pray. Father, in the name of Jesus. Remove all the Lord. Every ungodly spirit that can make my children to be useless. Every ungodly spirit that can make my seed. Every time we are praying. Let 
touch your spirit, begin to dwell inside my own children in the name of Jesus. Please pray that prayer. Pray that prayer. Parents, don't deceive yourself. How for the spirit of obedience and me, God, the spirit of holiness, let it come upon my child. Let it come inside of them in the name of Jesus. Spirit of truth, I invite you into the life of my children. So shall it be. As you have prayed, so shall it be. In the name of Jesus. Number eight, you're going to invite God. I am happy for as many parents that are here tonight. And the Lord says, He will bless you abundantly. You will see the reward. Many will dream and they will see their children being taken from gutter, from college, from peace, unto glory. Says the Lord. And so shall it be. Don't forget, you're going to get Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Touch my child. Teach my child. The word must not teach them. Call him by name. He's the teacher. He said, Lord Jesus, I release my children. I release my children. Mention their name. I said, Lord, I want you to touch them. I want you to teach them. The world that we are is full of darkness. They must not be taught by the world. Lord, you are the teacher. You are the teacher. Teach my children. Every parent, pray that prayer. Every child here, pray that prayer. The Lord teach me. You are the teacher. I don't want to be taught by this world. You are the teacher. Teach me. Teach my children. Taught my children. Taught my son. Taught my seed. In the name of Jesus. Pray the prayer. Please pray. Parents here, pray. I want you to pray the prayer. Open your mouth and pray. Open your mouth and pray. Everyone here. Say, Lord, I release my children. Teach them. Touch them. In the name of Jesus. Teach them. So shall it be. The master himself. And that is Jesus Christ. He will teach your child. Cash it. It is for you. The master himself. And he is the teacher of all teachers. He will teach your children. In the name of Jesus. Number nine. You're going to go before the Lord. Say, Lord Jesus. Therefore, must not use my seed. As a weapon of sorrow for me. Do you know how many how many parents that are crying to that today because of children? They are regretting they have children. You are going to go. The devil is using them as a weapon for this prayer. You are going to go before the Lord. Say, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Devil must not use my children as a weapon of sorrow for me. One time to pray. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus, I can see your parents. They are tired already. They are tired already.
Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. I reveal failure. I reveal failure for her. I reveal failure for me. I reveal failure for George. For George, I reveal failure. In the name of Jesus. Say, Lord, I reveal failure. I reveal failure. I reveal failure. I reveal failure. I pray again for you. For all my sins. In the name of Jesus. My sins shall not fail. In the name of Jesus. I speak against failure. In the name of Jesus. Every spirit of failure, I reject you. Concerning my sins. In the name of Jesus. Spirit of failure. I speak against you. Concerning my sin. In the mighty name of Jesus. Spirit of failure. I speak against you. Concerning me. Concerning my children. Concerning my family. In the name of In the mighty name of Jesus, pray and pray. Speak against failure. My children is not fair. You. Pray against failure. Pray against failure. Yes. Every child that comes from my womb, you will not suffer failure. Whether in the family or not. My children is not fail. Rachel will not fail. Elizabeth is not fail. Ah, you will not fail. In the mighty name of Jesus. Mention the names of your children. Mention them one by one. I will do failure. Say so whatever failure means, my children will not know you. Whatever definition of failure, my whole sins shall not know you. Whatever failure means in life, I return tonight. I return tonight. Failure for any of my children. In the name of Jesus. I return failure for all my sins. In the name of Jesus. As you are saved, so shall it be. I reduce and I reject failure. Concerning your sin. In the name of Jesus. They will not know failure. They will not hear failure. They will not operate in failure. They will not run their life in failure. They will not walk in failure. In the name of Jesus. I In 11th prayer point. Today, children go around and keep saying, I am tired. I am tired. I am fed up. How would I be? I am tired. I am fed up. Pray as a prayer. Every spirit of tiredness. Every voice of I am fed up. That may bring my child to be a useless one. I reject tonight. Spirit of tiredness. I reject concerning my children. They will not be tired. His life is a race. My whole child must not be tired. My whole child, my children shall not be tired. Spirit of tiredness. Spirit of I am fed up. I am not doing it again. I am tired. Every spirit of I am tired. I reject concerning my sin. In the name of Jesus. Say, Lord Jesus. Say, Lord Jesus, I have brought my children. Remove tiredness of any form from them. Say, Lord Jesus, I have brought my sin to you. Remove spirit of tiredness. Every voice of I'm fed up, I reject concerning them. Every spirit of I'm tired, I have fed up. I can't go, I can't do it. I reject concerning my sin. In the name of Jesus, see I speak and I decree by the authority of Jesus, my children, you shall not be tired, you shall not be worried. In the name of Jesus, see I release strength, I release strength. Pray and fulfill your vow. Say in the name of Jesus, I release strength into your life, Rachel. I release strength into your life, Elizabeth. I release strength into your life. And it leads strength into your life. So shall it be. As you are praying, so shall it be. Your children will not be tired. They will not be weary. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. 12. 
every mark of discrimination and condemnation I erase upon my seat. They shall not be condemned. They shall not be discriminated. In the mighty name of Jesus. On that to prayer. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus. I cannot hear your voice. I want you to pray that prayer very well. <laughs> this is a word of competition. My own child shall not be discriminated. My children shall not be discriminated. My children shall not be condemned. In the name of Jesus. For a pray that prayer, please. Every mark of condemnation, every mark of discrimination upon my children, I raise by the blood of Jesus. I raise by the blood of Jesus. Every mark of condemnation, every mark of discrimination, I erase tonight. Begin to erase it. My whole children, you shall not be discriminated against. You will not be condemned in the name of Jesus. My children, you will not and you shall not be condemned. You will not be discriminated against by the name of Jesus. Parents, pray that prayer. Children, pray that prayer. If your parents Number 13. You will have God to choose for your children. Is it life? And we are in the culture of by one. They are too free. A life of multiple choices. And if the girl make wrong choice, it can lead to destruction. No matter how glorious it can be. Go before the Lord as a concerned parent. Say, Lord, I have released them to you. Choose for them, O oh Lord. They must not make the wrong choice in life. Turn back to prayer. Hey, parents! Open your mouth. Parents! Open your mouth. Say, Lord, my children must not make wrong choices. In the name of Jesus. They must not make wrong choices. In the name of Jesus. My children must not make wrong choices. Pray, 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 pray. Pray! My children, they will not make wrong choices in life. In the name of Jesus, no, choose for my children. Say, God, Jesus, choose for them. Wrong decisions they shall not make. In the name of Jesus, my children shall not make wrong choices. In the mighty name of Jesus, pray that prayer. As a parent, pray. As a child, pray that we will not make wrong choices. In the name of Jesus, decisions that will lead to destruction. Your children will not take. In the name of God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit. In the name of Jesus. Number 14. As a parent, I always remember the stress and the struggle that I passed through in life. I passed through in Lord. It was so much. And I always use that as a reference to pray for my children every point in time when I have opportunity. The kind of stress, the kind of struggle that I pass through in life, ma. My children must not taste it. They must not. And I'm sure every parent here will have one or two or three tough, tough, tough life that we have passed through. And we dare not expect and even pray that our child goes through it. Pray that prayer. Say, Lord, the stress and struggle that I have passed through, my seed must not pass through them. Come back to prayer. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, the stress and the struggle of life that I have passed through, let none of my children, let none of my seed pass through thoughts in the name of Jesus. Say, Father, I have brought my children, they must not pass through the suffering that I pass through. They must not pass through the sadness that I pass through. The suffering that I endure 
My children must not enjoy it. In Yati Monte, Omami Ogodo Je, in Yati Monte, I want Mami Ogodo Je, the suffering, the suffering that I pass through, my sin must not pass through In the name of Jesus, pray that prayer, pray that prayer, pray that prayer, pray that the stress, the struggle that I pass through in life, my children must not pass through In Yati Monte, Mami Ogodo Je, Omami Ogodo Je. In your team, I'm going to be In your world of death, the suffering that my father passed through, I must not pass through. Should you pray that prayer? Please pray that prayer. Every parent, if you love your child, pray that prayer. Yes. As you are praying, so shall it be. Parent, if your child are with you, teach them to pray. I am begging you. You are not helping yourself. If you are the one who is not do 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 and you are not doing anything, you are deceiving yourself. Is there your future? There's nothing a pastor can do. There's nothing any man of God can do. You are the first pastor in that family. You are the first prophet. If you miss your role, there's nothing any man of God can do. Teach your children to pray. Help yourself. Number fifteen. You're going to go before the Lord. Say, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Remove my children's name, Remove my children's name. From, prison list. from prison list. I'm waiting for parents to pray this. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus. Remove my whole children's name. From prison list. From crime list. From drug dealer's list. From dealer's list. From sickness list. Sickness, sickness. Child Ismail and he had mercy upon the mother. 
you are going to go to the Lord. Look at my seat. And be merciful upon me as a prayer. Come back to prayer. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, look at my children. Behold my children. And have mercy upon me. Behold my seed. And have mercy upon me. As you have mercy upon a guy. Look, oh Lord, at the children that you have given me. And be merciful upon me. As a father, as a mother. Look at my children, oh Lord. Say, Father, with your merciful eyes, with your merciful eyes, look at the children you have given unto me. Hear their cry and be merciful unto me. There are times the Lord needs to look at the children and be merciful upon the family and be merciful upon the prayer. Say, Lord, behold my sin. Behold my sin and bless me. Behold my children and bless me. Behold my sin and bless me. Look at my children and bless me. Look at the sin that you have given me and hearken to my voice. So shall it be. Amen. Amen. Pray against sudden death. In London, the load is close to 200 now. Between the ages of 13 to 25, that are dead. Young one. Children of some prayerful mother, children of righteous one like you and I, go before the Lord. Say every mark of sudden death upon my seed, upon my children, I erase tonight. Come down to prayer. Lord, oh Lord, by your mercy, oh Lord, remove, oh Lord, mark of untimely death, mark of sudden death upon. Every child here, pray. Mark of untimely death upon my seed. I erase by the blood of Jesus. Mark of untimely death upon my children. I erase by the blood of Jesus. Begin to declare and declare. My children will not die young. Pray that my children, you will not die young. I declare and I declare. As you have paid, so shall it be. In the name of God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Ghost, you will pray. I have seen and I have heard. Growth is throughout lifetime until you are dead. Some child, they will grow from little one to that one, that one, that one, and as they grow that one, that one, from Newly to infant, to child, to adolescent, to man, their needs differs. You will pray. To say, Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus, to be a man, to be a man, to be a husband, to be a wife, to be a mother, for my children. It shall not be a struggle. And to pray. I want to see parents who can pray that we are good to the moment. To be a wife shall not be hard. Number 20. And we have four minutes. Who gets there? Yeah. You will pray. There's one thing I have known and I've learned money. As a prayer for faith, you can rearrange destiny. Yes. If there are so many children here, if they're a prayerful parent, you can pick your children from middle and put your child in front. Yes. By the power of prayer. Yes. 
Say Lord today. Whenever my children find themselves, they will be number one. Pray every day. Get pregnant again because the wife died during labor. Pray that way. I will not have regret. I regret regret for having children. These children, they will not be source of regret to me. Turn that to prayer. Pray that pray. You have two minutes. Pray that prayer very well. Pray that prayer, Father, in the name of Jesus. I speak against regret. I refuse to have regret. Concerning my children, in the name of Jesus, oh Lord, I must not be blamed for these children. So shall it be. In the name of God the Father, in the name of God the Son, in the name of our Holy Spirit. Amen. You lift up your hands, and I declare and I declare every word that you have uttered tonight. I need you to answer. In the name of Jesus, every word of supplication, every word of request that you have raised unto heaven, right from this moment, receive the answer. In the name of Jesus, your sins shall be glorious. Your sins are pictures. 